Hi, if you're experiencing the download error for NVIDIA GeForce drivers, go to your GeForce experience, <coughs> go to settings, and you want to enable automatically download driver updates and let me choose when to install. You can check that, exit out, and that's one fix because sometimes the automatic download uh, helps with that error but if you're still getting the error and if that didn't help we need to enable GeForce through the firewall you want to go to your search you want to type in firewall and uh, network protection and then you have an option to allow an app through firewall now here you want to click on change settings and you want to click on allow another app now you need to browse and you need to find the GeForce experience on your computer now if you don't know where GeForce Experience is, you can go to your search, GeForce Experience, right click, open file location. This is going to give you the file location for the shortcut, but then you have to right click and open file location again, and it's going to take you to the actual application itself. Now we want to take this path up here, if you click in your search bar, we're going to take this path right here, and we're going to copy it. We're going to go back to our firewall settings where we want to allow the app. We're going to browse and we're going to paste this exact place. It's not letting us because this last part is the application. So just delete that last part and it's still not working for some reason. If not, oh, and now it works. So does have some problems I guess NVIDIA GeForce Experience double click and we have the N NVIDIA GeForce Experience application right here you want to open that you want to add it and now it's added to your uh, Windows firewall and it's gonna allow it to access the internet and all the files uh, that are necessary for it to finish its driver download there should be no more problems with GeForce Experience. If you're still experiencing problems, I recommend just reinstalling the application itself and maybe try reinstalling your NVIDIA GeForce drivers. Good luck.